Hi guys, Joseph the World here, and today, yet again, we are talking about another disgusting nonce. But not just any nonce, the disgusting man you see on your screen right now is Nicholas Passmore, otherwise known as the Polite Nonce. And if you live in the UK, nonce means, uh, is a basically UK slang for predator, and if you live in the UK, you might have seen this clip before. It's crush, but you, you've been you've been quite polite actually. For non, some of the nonces we get, you know, they're like the the regressive and stuff. You know. I mean, I mean, I'm not I'm not a bad lad. No, no, no you're not. You're a nonce, but you no. know, you might not be. But you, you, you know, you shouldn't really do it. Nicholas Passmore was communicating with what he thought to be a 13 or 14 year old girl. It wasn't. A 13 or 14 year old girl it was actually a predator hunting group known as predator exposure which basically means they had a decoy adult to pretend they were a child to you know catch these predators talking and trying to groom them and you know this stuff they turn up to his house and obviously confront him where he's obviously a bit shaken up and well, obviously that happens, the clip I just showed you, and he admits to doing it and swears he won't do it again if they let him go. Obviously, they don't let him go. They've said they've already found the police. And he then proceeds to start crying. At that point, the predator hunter says some of this. this. I do want to read some of it. You can read, can't you? You're not crying there, are you? Eh? It's too late to no, cry. I thought so. Look at that, man. You sad cum. Right, let's have a look. What's up with you? Yeah. You don't want to what? You want to go? Yeah. You. I don't want to go. You don't want to go away. Tell tell police that and tell that to courts. Or do you want a pen? Do you want a pen? To what? To write to someone who gives a fuck. <laughs> and even though I have found this thing pretty funny, and I'm sure numerous other people have this kind of cost them later down the road throughout all of the non-sting they're pretty much you know taking the piss out of him uh you know swearing at him calling him names whatever and as much as i get it these guys are predators like i'm the last one to de defend these disgusting little cunts it ended up cost costing them later down the road in court, which let's talk about what happened afterwards. He was obviously arrested afterwards, and because of their unprofessionalism in, you know, the verbal harassment and what counts as verbal harassment and stuff, the polite nonce, Nicholas Passmark, didn't get charged at all, even though he admitted on camera to, you know, knowing this girl was underage and talking to her and was asking to do this, have intercourse with her, even though he was fully aware of her age because of their unprofessionalism and uh, verbal harassment, as stated here on the website. They were charged, the actual predator hunters themselves was charged with false imprisonment, which is... This is why I say, even though I do support most of these predator hunters on most occasions, like Dark Justice, who are a lot more professional in this, um, basically they usually, this can cost them in court, because even though they've given an admission to doing this, it does not count legally, because there was pressure and, you know, they were obviously being very unprofessional, swearing, calling them names, etc. Et so they were obvious. So they've been charged with false imprisonment. Or the paedophile hunters were charged with uh, false imprisonment. Uh, they appeared in Leeds Crown Court and they pleaded not guilty. Now there is footage of them outside of the courthouse, but I don't really think I need to show it. But I believe they didn't get charged. I believe they got charged. Sorry, they got every person involved got charged with three counts of something. But I believe the charges were dropped or they were found innocent. So 
does that. So this is why I say, please, if you are going to do this, even I don't encourage it because it could be dangerous for people who are obviously not trained for this. Um, do it professionally, please, and make sure you don't do anything that's illegal so you, you'll be the one getting charged and end up getting this paedophile off. Like, he didn't get charged at all. He's not on a sex offenders register. He's not on a sexual harm prevention order. He's not taking any kind of therapy. Now, he might be, but he's not being sent to any program. He got away with it. And honestly, that's ridiculous. But yeah, that's all the updates I have on this guy. The polite nonce got away with it. Anyway, make sure to like and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit. Peace. <laughs>